Hey, come on in, come on in. Thanks a lot for taking some time to get to know us uh, and to see a little bit of our home. Um, we're really excited to share a bit of information about both with you. Um, we bought this house about a year ago, um, and we, uh, when we were looking, we wanted to make sure that we found a place that had uh, plenty of bedrooms because we knew that we wanted to start a family. So we found this great place. Um, it's in a diverse and really um, family-centered neighborhood uh, in Washington, D.C. Um, and we've been together for about 10 years, and we've been married for a little over five years, and ever, ever since we've been together, we knew that we wanted to have kids, and we've been thinking about it and planning for it, and now we finally are ready to start a family. Um, and we can't wait to invite a child of any race or any gender into our lives and to um, help us um, become a family. So we're going to show you a little bit around the house and tell you a little bit about us. So this right here is our dog, Penny. She's an eight-year-old beagle, and as you can tell, she really loves eating treats. In this case, right now, it's peanut butter. She is a super sweet dog. She loves going for walks in D.C., loves smelling all that there is to smell on the sidewalks, and she really, really likes our um, nephews and nieces and kids. She is super patient and loves it when they pet her and tug on her tail. She really doesn't mind, so we're really excited because we think she's excited to have a human brother or sister sometime soon. So uh, one of the things that I really love about Andy and one of the reasons why I think he'll be a really great father and parent is that he's very patient. Um, that's an important skill set in being a parent and um, he's patient with me, he's patient with the dog, he's um, very patient with the kids, uh, he, he's great with our nephew and niece with our friends' kids um, every Saturday, Andy Tudor is reading to, how old are they, like nine years, nine or ten years old? Yeah, anywhere from like five to, to 10 or 11. It's a good mix of patience, but also a sense of fun. So one of the things that I really love about Galtham and that I think will actually make him an amazing parent is um, the fact that he's so passionate and caring about whatever he sets his mind to. And that often comes apart or comes across as uh, his just being very responsible. His compassion and caring also comes through in his ability to organize uh, fun birthday parties for me, for himself. Um, I think he's really excited about being able to do that um, for our children um, when we have them. Um, and he's just amazing at, at things like that and really anything that he sets his mind to. I like to plan. Really like to plan. So this is the baby room or nursery. We painted a mural. Uh, we actually had a lot of help from Gautam's parents. Um, his mom actually sketched this entire uh, design and picture, um, and we each played a part in painting it. So this room is actually right next to our bedroom, so we thought it would be the perfect place to actually have um, a space for... And that's our bedroom right down the hall. Okay, and so as you're coming up the stairs to the second floor of our house, the first room you'll see is our office. So this is where Gautam works during the day. Most days he works from home, uh, and this is his space. Uh, it's also a place where Penny the dog likes to hang out. Uh, you can hear her downstairs, and we even have her crate right here. So when we leave the house, we usually put her in there for the time that we're gone. And then, if you walk straight out of the office, you'll see the nursery, which we saw a little bit earlier. And then, onto our bedroom. This is the uh, master bedroom. You'll see it is right next to the uh, baby room. We've got lots of natural light. And you can see from our bedroom, we're overlooking our street. Um, again, really, really nice neighborhood. Lots of families um, near lots of parks. Um, and yeah, we can't wait to have kids running around the street here. So we're both very lucky to have uh, loving, supportive families um, that are really excited for us to adopt. They've been asking us for about five years uh, when are we going to have kids. It's been a long time. Since we got married. Mm -hmm. um, and so they are, they're just really excited to have grandkids and to be able to bring uh, a young person into our lives and to teach them things. Um, Even my brother is excited. Yeah. My yeah. younger brother. Ready to be an uncle. Yeah. Um, and so, you know, we're really excited to have their support because we're going to need it. We're going to need all the help we can get, I'm sure. Um, but things like, I know my mom and dad are excited to be able to teach um, a little kid how to 
play the guitar and how to paint. Yeah. Um, and your dad knows how to fix things around the house. And, yeah. yeah. And uh, likes to be out in the outdoors, so I'm sure that he'll be excited to do things like camping or even hiking, things like that. Um, whether it be here around DC or up in up in Maine where I grew up. So. And we we just had um, all of them here for Christmas for the holidays for the first time ever. We hosted nine family members in our house, which was a lot of fun, a little crazy, but. Um, kind of the best way to spend the holidays all together in one place um, and you know it's our, it's our sort of like a new tradition for us since uh, you know growing up I didn't have that many people in the house so this will be a lot of fun and the idea is hopefully next year they'll be here for Christmas and there'll be a baby around too. And everyone behaved. Which everyone was really behaved good. which was great. Yes. Can't guarantee that. Yeah. Uh, thank you again for taking a few minutes to get to know us. Again our names are Gautam and Andy and we are so excited to adopt a child of any race or gender into our lives and uh, we really hope that we'll get a chance to talk to you further about this.